So in this video we're going to make um, another little miniature food item and we're going to do chocolate. So I've just got some brown fondant mixed with a little bit of modelling and flour paste. Now mine smells quite strong of chocolate because I bought chocolate flavoured. Um, I'll put some links below to the tools that I use in the video, um, in the description bit. So I've literally started by just rolling it out and we're literally just going to cut a rectangle like so. So to get some straight lines I'm just going to use a ruler and I'm going to press this into my fondant to create a line and then I'm going to press it just slightly either way so that it creates like a bit of a v-shape so they become a bit more like chocolate bar shapes so again halfway between these ones here we're going to put that in I am guessing the distance here so if you want to measure it and be a bit more accurate than me that's fine they're not hugely lifelike chocolate bars but they're still quite nice for decorating the tops of cupcakes and cakes with okay obviously try and get them a bit more even than me and what we'll do now is just do it the opposite way and make sure they're a little bit longer than they are wide and again we're just moving our ruler backwards and forwards so my end ones have ended up being a little bit longer I'll just angle them a little bit the edges by pushing my ruler in at an angle knocked it out of place a bit there okay so that's one chocolate bar I've got another one here to do another one in another colour so a dark chocolate one and a milk chocolate one um, but I won't make you sit and watch and I'll show you that when it's done if you want it to, to look like you've got like teeth marks out find a cutter where it's um, serrated so I've got a flower one so I've got the next size up and I'm just going to push that into my bar a couple of places and I'm just going to use the handle of my paintbrush to just push that in there so it looks like you've got a bit of a bite missing from your chocolate okay so we've got one there in another colour if you want to cut it down so that like the broken piece is off again just slice up the little pieces that you've used like so that's it thank you for watching if you liked this video and would like to see more, please click on the images of the other videos suggested. Also, please do subscribe to my channel using the button at the bottom right hand corner of the screen. You can also visit my cake website and my Facebook page to see more cakes and ideas.